China is showing the fires burning right now in Canada. More than 490 active tonight. That's a lot of dots on that map. We're told many of those fires in hard to reach areas making the situation worse. Holly Brantley outside tonight with how the fires are impacting us locally. Holly. Right, conditions can change really quickly. We can actually still feel it a bit in the air out here tonight, but we did see some blue sky this afternoon at the farmer's market. That brief break, a relief to vendors and patrons. Health experts saying the best way to get permanent relief, stay inside or wear an N95 mask like this. Suffocating, irritating. That's how people at the Green Bay Farmer's Market describe this smoky situation. The air quality was terrible. Yes. And coming down here, my eyes watered. I was coughing. At Beaverbrook Foods, the Goddards saying they've been coming to the market for 20 years and they've never seen smoke and haze like this. No, no never, right? never. As long as they're burning, we're going to get smoke. Over at the booth for OJ's Midtown restaurant, owners agree. I think it's definitely hindered us a little bit tonight, but um, it seems like we still got a pretty good crowd. Still patrons saying in spite of the smoke, they couldn't stay away. It's pretty bad and you can actually smell it now too. Yeah. You know, it's quite noticeable. Yeah, this haze is, get, well, it's like living in Southern California. While the farmer's market continued, many outdoor events in Green Bay and the Fox Cities canceled altogether. The DNR saying this is a dynamic situation with conditions that could change rapidly as the wildfires burn in Canada, now breaking an annual record for wildfire smoke emissions. There always is a wildfire season, except for really wet years. Uh, in Canada, it just started earlier this year. It usually starts in July, and, and they're used to having a lot of the uh, fires in the remote areas and a lot of their areas that are, they're not extinguishing the fires. It's kind of a let burn um, policy right now. And um, I guess that's their, their normal practice. So far, the DNR says the areas in Wisconsin with the worst air quality are along the Lake Michigan shoreline down to Milwaukee. DHS recommending people keep activity outdoors light and short. If you do have a respiratory or cardiovascular health condition that puts you at greater risk, um, and need to, need to spend time outside, um, a well-fitting N95 mask may be helpful, but generally we recommend that for the duration of this um, air quality event, um, staying indoors is, is probably the best thing to do. We could see a break for the smoke in the next couple of days, but... If that weather changes at all, there's a chance we could get more smoke impacts. And we aren't alone. NPR now saying parts of Europe are seeing hazy skies from the wildfires. Live in Green Bay, Holly Brantley, Action 2 News.